Oh, you want some? Can I? Well, you are my little sister. Oh, I hope you're not allergic. Guys don't like girls who sneeze. Perfume, makeup. Seems like just last week I was wiping pablum off that kid's face. Where do the years go, Hank? Mostly into your lower back. Gray hair. The malfunctioning of various appendages. It's the kids that do it. It's all their fault. Entirely. I figure once Walt and Vicky finally move out, I'll transmogrify. Return to my former state and look exactly like Brad Pitt. Hell, I'm sure Brad's staying up nights thinking of that possibility. Well, he has Angelina to stay up with. Back by midnight, no drinking. Hmm. I won't if you won't. Well, that's another gray hair. Oh, yeah, Mom forgot to tell you. Um, Mick called earlier. He's back. Uh, bye. When did he call? What did he say? I'll tell you later. Mick's back. The hair on my back just turned gray. Hank, wake up. They're not back yet. What? The girls. They're still out and it's past midnight. Well then, we know who's gonna wash my truck tomorrow. Go to sleep, baby. They're just kids being kids. Yeah. Hello? It's a hospital. Yeah? Okay. Nothing's broken. They checked you out. They said there's nothing. You're not hurt. Well, good. That means your mind to hurt. Car's a total write-off. Roll a couple times and land in between two trees. You don't know how lucky they are. How'd it happen? Excessive speed up on Highway 63. No signs of drugs or alcohol. A guy named Charlie David was at the wheel. Escaped without a scratch. Just dumb luck, eh? Well, the other guy in the car wasn't quite so lucky. You know him? No. Huh. We're in college together. <sighs> oh, no, Mick! Oh, baby. What, what is this? Broken wrist. Oh. Kind of like uh, two paddles. Oh, honey. Ah. Oh, it's all good. I'm sorry. I'm sorry. Can I be the first one to sign that? Oh, honey, did I hurt you? You know how to spell? I'll get a pen. So, how long do you have those things on for? Six weeks, they say. You're gonna have to stay here. And you are grounded for two weeks. You go to school, you come right back here. Oh, and no TV. Oh, Mom. I mean it. Don't I, Hank? Yeah, that's right. And you too. That's it. You're grounded. Two weeks, no TV, no nothing. But, Dad, you... No butts. This is a no-butt table. <laughs> Hank. 
Hank, I gotta go. Don't go. I'm gonna need help. With my zipper? You sit right there, Florence Nightingale. Come on. Weird. Bet you thought you were gonna be like the James Bond of plumbing with this, eh? Bond. James Bond. Double O number two. With all the glamour and the girls and such. And well, this is the girls' washroom. Well, look, that thing's plugged tighter than a reservation on Treaty Day. What, you guys don't think that's funny? Josie told me that. She, she said it was very funny. Uh, you know what? I think I went to grade 12 for this. Uh, OK. Grade 6 twice. I have an idea. No, oh, great creator, save us. He's got an idea. Oh, I got a better idea. How's it going? Good, good, great. Did you want me to make you something to eat? A bologna sandwich? Fried? Fresh is okay. So, how'd it go down there? Rapid City? Good. Liar. Okay, could have gone better. Now, tell me the truth. He's a chauvinistic, rude, lazy SOB. Hmm. You must have caught him on a good day. Uh, mayo? Mustard. He's got a girlfriend. Filipino. He didn't even know anything about me, Kate. Yeah. I thought your mom told him about you years ago. It's not something that you bring up on a regular basis, that your common-law has a kid with your sister. Mom doesn't tell him anything. You don't tell him anything. All these years. I'm up here. He's down there. What are you doing? I'm pointing. Pointing. Eat your sandwich, Mick. This puppy, this will loosen up that poop and put it on the run, eh? Grab the ladder for me. <sighs> no, she's tighter than an Irishman on a Friday night. What, nothing? I get nothing on that line. It's a great line, man. What are you two idiots doing? We're playing hide and go seek, buddy. Good job, you found us. Now it's your turn to go hide. We're plumbing. What does it look like we're doing? You're taking the building apart. Well, you know why that is? Because we got a big glob of stuff in there that won't come out. And guess what? Stewed prunes aren't working. Well, now, free it then. But don't damage company property. You know what? Maybe you'd like to give it a shot. I got a pair of pliers in the truck, or maybe I could unclog a whole bunch of different pipes with this. How would you like to? Just, just, just. It's okay. It's okay. I, I got an idea. <laughs> oh, you got an idea? I got a great okay, idea. Easy, okay? I, I got a better idea. <laughs> did you see? Did you see him poke me? Excuse me. No TV. Two weeks. Have we forgotten? It's not real television. It's just a soap opera. <sighs> nice try. Don't you even want to know if Charlene is pregnant? I don't care to know about pregnancies. Is this more of your cool stepmother act? You know what? I think it is. The bathroom awaits. What? Go clean the bathroom. Right downstairs? 
Off you go. And don't forget the toilet. Watch out, we're gonna have Niagara Falls here, brother. Ah, oh, great. Now I'm gonna smell like liberal promises. Hey, guys. Not only will it, you know, liquefy the poop, but it will create pressure in the pipe, shoot the blockage right on through. You, my friend, have a genius for a son. He's like the soap crates of the sewage or the, the Play-Doh of poop or whatever. That's, that's a good idea right there. Grandpa Kowalczyk would be proud. All right. Hey, don't you guys burn the place down. It's mostly made out of concrete anyway. Let's get this party started. Where's your scoochy thing? Right here, man. Okay. What are they doing now? The stink in here is unbelievable. We're applying thermal technology. Oh. I wouldn't go in there if I were you. Anybody you want me to call? What are you doing? Oh, I'm brushing his teeth. Okay, I guess. What was that? Oh, we're dating. Actually, we're in love. You know, like like boyfriend and girlfriend? Huh. Oh! Yosie! You? Is that all you can say? Yeah. What is going on between you and Vicky? She's your sister, for God's sake! She's not really my sister. Yeah, well, according to the law, she is. I don't care if she likes you or you like her. It's not happening. Do you understand me? What can I say, Mom? I'm a chick magnet. We'll go find another fridge to stick to. Mom, did you know that Mark my new dad didn't know anything about me. Kate hadn't told him anything either. But she made it seem like... Do either of you know how that makes me feel? Like an inconvenience, an embarrassment, like I don't exist. new hell is this? You can blab the whole thing to Mick and you can't tell his father? Why didn't you tell him? Why didn't you? She could use a new dream catcher. Ah, she's got her webs a little twisted. Hey. Hey! <laughs> Come on! Oh my God, Come on, up there! <laughs> Jake! Come hey! On. I thought I said no TV. Oh, I'm not. Mick is. Can you uh, change the channels again, babe? Babe? 
thought that was a movie about a little piggy. Nah. Next. Next. Hang on, what's this? Next. Next. Listen, man, there's one thing I've learned in this business. Let's never send a boy to do a man's job. <laughs> or two of them. Uh. The ways of our forefathers are wise. That's, uh, that's never gonna work, man. Never. From hell's heart, I stab at thee. Listen. Do you hear that? It's gurgling, man. It's working. Something sure stinks. Dad, hurry up with the other bottle of shampoo. Something smells really bad. Yeah, it's, uh, that's, yeah, I think your Aunt Kate, she's cooking again. And, uh, but don't say anything because, you know, she's kind of sensitive. Whatever. After that, we'll try kerosene. Hank. Do me a favor. Change channels for me. Girl party's on. Oh, uh, yeah? I never heard of that. Oh, you'd love it. Plenty of babes. Well, why don't we just see what's on? Bowling. Now, there's a sport for you. You know, it takes about a half an hour or so to really really get into it. But once you once you discover the, the idiosyncratic moves of each bowler, there's something noble about the lone warrior standing against ten defiant pins. No, huh? I thought you were a big sports guy. Oh, the Weather Channel. Now, there you have the entire Earth spread out before you. I believe there's some activity beneath the equator there. Could that be cyclonic rotation? Ah, it's raining in Cairo. How about that? How often do you think it rains in Cairo? Is that girl party thing? Your father can be a real wiener sometimes. Oh, really? I, I never really noticed. Do you want something to eat? You know I do, babe. What do you want? Oh, whatever you can make, whatever you could whip up. Do you want the same sandwich I made you this morning? That'd be perfect, babe. Only this time, not so much mustard. Last time you slopped it all over the place. Dripped all over my white t-shirt, remember? Ruined it. Can't get a stain like that out. Third cycle did it, Dad, no problem. This stuff smelled like roses. 
good, great. Oh, uh, Walt. Yeah? You know, I was thinking, uh, what happened today? You know, that is not typical in the daily life of a plumber. And it was your first day and all, so I don't want you to start thinking that that's what it's going to be like. No, I know that, Dad. You know, someday you'll think of that as just a just a funny story that you have to tell. You know, I got lots of them. The mysteries of plumbing. I, I know that about today, Dad. Still, the truth is, I, I don't think I want to be a plumber. Sorry. You don't? Well, what, what do you think you would like to do? Well, actually, I've been thinking about that, and I've decided... Ballet dancer. Dad? Kidding. Should never have bought him that book on Pilates. Hang on. It's not cold enough. What do you mean you haven't tried it yet? I can just tell. Be a doll and go get some ice. Hey, you know what I could go for right now? No, what could you go for? Some salt and vinegar chips and beef jerky. Well, I'm sorry we don't have any salt and vinegar chips and beef jerky. I know. You'd have to run down to the corner store and get some. You want me to run to the corner store and buy you some salt and vinegar chips and beef jerky? Yeah, you're not doing anything right now. I mean, I'd go with you, but I feel like an idiot with these things on. Okay. Do you have any money? You know, I'm tapped out right now. But uh, hey, you know I'm good for it, right? Babe, the water. Hey, hey, careful. You almost got me again. Remember the mustard? Oh man, are you nuts? You think we should investigate this? I won't if you won't. Uh, 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 that is the man's scepter of power. Am I not your queen? Ugh. All right, what do you want to watch? Not that. Next. 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 What? Go, go back. trip.